Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can reset disabled iPhone, iPad screen lock without using iTunes application. This method is really straightforward and easy to remove a locked screen password from your iOS devices in just 3 steps. Make sure you guys watch this video till the end. Also hit that like button and let's get started. Before starting the video, I would like to mention that we are doing a giveaway. We are giving you 5 free license codes for the software. The link will be in the description below, but watch the video till the end to hear more about the giveaway. Alright, the software which I am going to use for this demonstration is 4 Yuki by Tenishare. I will put a direct link for this website in the description below. 4 Yuki is a great tool for removing locked screen devices such as iPhone, iPad and iPod Touch. It doesn't matter whether you have set a 4-digit custom numeric code or 6-digit alphanumeric passcode. You can get rid of the password including Touch ID and Face ID info without any hassle. 4 Yuki is available for Mac and Windows operating system. Guys it is completely safe and legal process of unlocking your iPhone. Whenever you forgot your password all you have to do is. Just download it onto your Windows and install it. Well if you have a Mac then you can download it for that as well. Well, I will go ahead and download it for my Windows PC. Now open the software that you have installed. And here you will find two different options which are unlock lock screen passcode and unlock Apple ID. Just go to the unlock lock screen passcode. Now you're gonna have to connect your locked or disabled iPhone to the computer using a lightning cable. And then click start to begin the process of unlocking when the device is detected successfully. If the program fails to detect the connected device, then you will have to put it in DFU mode or recovery mode. Just follow the on-screen instructions to do that with ease. Once your device is successfully detected by the software, the software will prompt you to download the most recent iOS firmware for it. Select a path and then click download to proceed. Wait for a couple of minutes that the firmware should be ready for the installation. It'll take around 10 to 30 minutes, depends on your internet speed. If you already have the firmware file on your computer, just click on the select button and then you're gonna have to locate the firmware file. Once the download is complete, you will be able to start unlocking your iPhone without a passcode. Before starting this process I would like to inform you that. This process will erase all of your data on the phone. And if you do not have iCloud backup you will lose all your data. Make sure you have a backup of your data. Now click unlock now to begin the process. You have to wait for some time until the process is successfully completed. Make sure to keep your device connected to your computer. After the process completes, Tenishare 4 Yuki will say that the passcode has been removed, and your iPhone will say hello. If this screen looks familiar to you, that's because it's the initial setup screen that you saw when you took your iPhone out of the box for the very first time. Once your iPhone is activated, you can select a new passcode. On the following screen, you can restore from an iCloud backup, iTunes backup, or set up your iPhone as new. Afterwards, continue to follow the on-screen instructions until you reach the home screen. Congratulations, you just bypassed your iPhone's passcode. So that is how you can reset disabled iPhone, iPad screen lock without using iTunes. And as I said in the beginning of the video, we are doing a giveaway. We are giving you 5 free licenses for the software. I will leave a link in the description to enter this contest. Apart from the giveaway there is a 30% discount coupon. So what you guys are waiting for? Just go ahead and get 4 Yuki with 30% off. Hope you guys enjoyed the video, if you did be sure to drop a like to this video and make sure to subscribe for more videos, so thanks again for watching guys and I'll see you soon.